tú me dijo, no, 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 no. yo hablo español y tú inglés, okay. estamos en Miami, ok, todo se puede. Hello, welcome to another episode of Crazy and Cutie, bum bum, with me, Daisy. As you can see, we're in a different setting today, and that's because I'm back in my hometown of Miami, Florida, in the Manuela's house, which is where I grew up. Which means I got a special guest on the show today. Everyone, welcome my abuela! <laughs> today, we wanted to do something Christmassy, but it was also something that my abuela would like, and she loves anything with guava, and she loves sweets. Puede hablar en español si quiere, yo puede poner los subtitles abajo. So, we're gonna make some guava shortbread cookies for Christmas. Now, guava shortbread cookies, I think, are actually a Puerto Rican thing, but we're gonna do them anyways, even though we're Cuban. It's okay. We, we love guava and we love cookies. We're gonna get this started with our ingredients. We're gonna be using a pinch of salt, half a teaspoon of vanilla extract, a teaspoon of almond extract, half a cup of vegan butter alternative, I like to use Earth Balance, half a cup of vegetable shortening. In here, I have half a cup of white sugar, I have two cups of flour, and we have a block of guava cake. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna preheat the oven to 350 degrees. <laughs> now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna mix the butter, the vegan butter alternative, and the vegetable shortening. I want to get a little bit of those cosas and then we'll go. Okay, touch. We're gonna use this little hand mixer to mix it all together. If you don't have a hand mixer, that's okay. You can just use a spatula. I'm gonna start with the low setting first. Oh my goodness, the daughter is best. <laughs> now, unfortunately, since I am not back at my apartment, I don't have my clear mixing bowl, so I'll just show you what it's going to look like. It's going to, I don't know if you can, if this is even focusing. Okay, wow, it's a pretty shot. Um, it's going to look like a whip, like a whip. Right, like a whip cream almost. Okay, tú le dice, go. Vamos a poner el azúcar. Todo. Todo. Uh -huh. Anything. Anything. Yes. That's half a cup of sugar. Mm -hmm. Um, so it's gonna look about the same as it did before, but now thicker because we added the sugar. Now we're gonna add our salt and both our vanilla and our almond extract. Down. I think I know. See. <laughs> So we're going to add the flour just little by little. So now my abuela is mixing it with a wooden spoon just because it was a little hard to mix the rest of it with the hand mixer. I was getting kind of tired. <laughs> now what I'm going to do is take a tablespoon size dough and we'll form it into a ball and put it on the sheet. Con la mano limpia. Sí, ya tenemos las manos limpias. Super. And once you have your sheet all filled up, you're going to use your thumb and you're going to press down on the cookie. Scoop out a half a teaspoon and we're going to put it inside the thumbprint that we just made. <gasps> now we're going to, they don't look like that. Look how yummy they look. We're going to pop them in the oven for about 11 minutes. Pero que facilidad, Oh my god. 
una fecha de un taller de granieta con tanto talento a ver ah, me equivoqué <laughs> no, no, we have the cookies out of the oven and they look so yummy. And now we're gonna taste them. Okay. Mmm. Yeah, it's really yummy. Yum, yum. They taste so Christmassy. Mmm. Mmm. Rico. Mm hmm. Oh my gosh, that's so good. This mm. might be one of the yummy things. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really recommend that you try these out. I think this has been one of my favorite things I've made on the channel. I'm like I'm like a hoe for cookies. I love cookies. I'm there. She loves cookies. So I have to say this is a favorite of mine. Definitely recommend you try it out. Even if even if you want to try it after Christmas, you can try it for New Year's. But they definitely are, since they're shortbread cookies, they are very Christmassy. Um, if you decide to try them out, take a picture and tag me on Instagram and I'll post on your story or on your feed. She says they're delicious. Um, and tag me at Daisy underscore the underscore little underscore mermaid. Thanks again for watching, and you know what they always say, by they I mean me. Stay cute, bake cute, and if you get the chance, donate cute animals. Goodbye! Bye.